smoke, baby. No. Smoke, boys! Two 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 we're splitting up this morning. Danny and Travis um, just left from camp. They're walking um, to what we call this table to the top of it. Me and Bryce are going another place and we're gonna get up somewhere high and see if we can't see some mule deer get bedded. And that is the game plan right now. And hopefully we can see some. It's uh, 34 degrees this morning. It's super cold this morning, um, but it's gonna warm up to about 80. So it's gonna get warm, um, but it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be a great time. Looking forward to it. All right, so we're gonna go sit on that very top right there. And we're gonna overlook this entire bottom. It's just cracking daylight. Like we can't see super clear, but 10 minutes from now, it'll be good. Hopefully, 10 minutes after that, deer will start showing up. So let's go get set up and see what we can see. There is a possibility that a mule deer is going to come screaming by pretty quick because we sat here last year on the fence line and they jumped the fence. Not really like in the same spot every time, so they can jump the fence anywhere, but then they come down into these guns. So the program that we're trying to do this morning is get a back, get a buck bedded for Danny. But if one comes by at 20 yards, I'm gonna shoot it. <laughs> but we'll see. I really want to shoot white tail, but hopefully one comes down and gets like in these cuts and we can get them bedded, and then go find Travis and bring him back. Find him hopefully he's still there. But that's the game plan. I didn't see anything. We're gonna keep walking back up and keep walking up and see if we can see down at a table, I'm guessing. Trav said we need to be in a spot where we can see like the ag fields and we can see the van, which the van right there. That's the neighbors, we can't go over there. We sat there last year. We didn't move very far, but we can see this entire fence line now. And they jump over this fence line. And they come into this bottom, so hopefully we see them jumping and then we can figure out where they're going. One, one, one. I'm just gonna freaking hold this thing. Well, boys and girls, it is very windy outside. Hopefully, you can hear me right now. But we essentially just went on a giant nature hike and uh, didn't see a deer. We saw some cows. Well, we saw a deer this morning, but we didn't see a deer like on our nature hike. But um, we're gonna head back to the van. It's like 1:30, 2 o'clock right now and uh, hopefully we can get there in like an hour. And uh, I guess Danny had some 
action this morning so meet up with those guys and see what they say and uh get after some white tails this afternoon but i'm ready for some microwave mac and cheese out of the van Well, we have about three hours of light left. Travis and Danny went off to where they sat last night, saw that decent 10 pointer, um, a couple other little eights. We're going somewhere new because the wind's a little different. Um, and we're actually put a trail camera out where we sat last night. So if there was action there tonight, then we'll know. But we're gonna go back up here just a little ways, a couple hundred yards, and uh, there's a ladder stand supposedly. So we're gonna find that. Um, and then Bryce is gonna be up in the saddle. And I have no idea what this looks like back in here, so we'll see. Should be good. Maybe a big buck will show up. Kind of cool. I don't know if you can hear me because it's so windy, but this ladder stand we just found it, it's in a giant tree. So, which is good, but the problem is, is the saddle strap and just the system, I don't know if it'll work. Well, I'm gonna go up there and see if I can get it up. If not, we're going to have to go back and get some sticks and uh, hang up on one of these smaller trees. But we might be able to get it work. Just do what I did, stand on top, clip in, and then move over. Does that look good for your angle? What? All right, everyone, it is afternoon number two and it is a windy one. It's currently six o'clock on September 26th. Sitting somewhere else than where we sat last night. It's pretty awesome views and um, the way the field set up and everything, it kind of pinches down right here. This ladder stand's been here forever. We'll see what happens. We literally have no expectations an hour before they'll start moving and hopefully they're moving in front of us and hopefully it's a big old buck because we're ready to get something on the ground. We made it back to camp. Danny and Travis didn't have much excitement at all, and we didn't have much excitement at all. So tomorrow, temperatures are gonna cool down. Hopefully that'll get the deer moving, and we'll be up and at it again tomorrow.